Alright, what's up you guys? I'm here with the ECW One Night Stand pay-per-views. We have four of them here. Two ECW and then two not so ECW. But let's get into it here. First up we have One Night Stand 2005. Uh, right off the bat, I actually really like this cover. I like the simplicity of it. You know, you have the barbed wire. You have the ECW logo. And then you, uh, you have the date down here, which is cool. But you also have thumbtacks in the place of the periods. Uh, that's something a lot of people might miss. But, you know, this is a great pay-per-view. Uh, as you know, I'm a huge ECW fan. I have my little ECW section up there. <clears throat> but, you know, this is four years after the company had been abolished. And um, so it's great to see, I guess, the crew back together. Uh, you have Axel Rott in there, the Dudleys, Balls Mahoney, Sandman. And what's ECW without Tommy Dreamer and Rhino? But uh, we have five matches here on the listing. Landstorm versus Chris Jericho. Rey Mysterio versus Psychosis. You have the three-way dance. I miss Tajiri, man. And then we have Eddie Guerrero versus Chris Benoit. And Eddie Guerrero, as you know, kind of sabotaged the match because he was not very happy. So they could have had a better match. And then you have Tommy Dreamer and the Sandman versus... Um, Bubba and Devon Dudley. And then you have um, the return of all the stars there. C.W. Anderson, Masato Tanaka. Good stuff. And then your disc art. There you have it. So I actually prefer 2006 over 2005. I just think, I just think it was a better show. Um, you have RVD cashing in his Money in the Bank briefcase against John Cena. And here's the backing. You had um, FBI versus Tajiri and Super Crazy. Taz versus Jerry the King Lawler. Balls Mahoney versus Masada Tanaka. Kurt Angle versus Randy Orton. And um, Tommy Dreamer and Terry Funk. And Beulah versus Mick Foley, Edge, and Lita. Love that match. And I also loved Rey Mysterio versus Sabu. And I thought that was an amazing match. And it could have been so much more. Um, I was actually just watching this one. So it's not in there at the moment. That's what made me want to do this. Because I was watching uh, 2006. But the good thing about this pay-per-view. You get barely legal with it. Uh, which was ECW's first pay-per-view. So that's really cool. And the disc artwork for that one. Very cool. I really like that they did that. And they even give you an insert. An extra insert. Which is really nice. Let's see what the artwork is. Very cool. So. Get that back in there. Alright. So. You know. Very. Very good. Uh, DVD, very well done that they actually added the pay-per-view. Alright, this is a blockbuster exclusive of One Night Stand Extreme Rules uh, 2007. Uh, we have Bobby Lashley on there. Not a huge fan of that cover, but it is what it is. But we had Mr. McMahon versus Bobby Lashley. Steel Cage Match, Edge versus Batista. RVD versus Randy Orton in a stretcher match. Uh, you have Molina versus Candice in a pudding match. Yeah. The Hardys versus the World's Greatest Tag Team in the ladder match for the tag team titles. And then a John Cena versus Great Khali in a Falls Count Anywhere match. And then the Blockbuster Discs, uh, disc I should say, gives you Cena and Lashley versus Shane, Umaga, and Great Khali. And then you get Saturday Night's Main Event, Boogeyman and Little Boogeyman. Versus Finley and Hornswoggle. Or Little Bastard as they used to call him. Alright. So. You, um, you know there's your pretty generic disc artwork. I'm actually not the biggest fan of this event. I think this is the weakest of the four. Uh, just. I don't know. It just didn't do it for me. And I just think they could have. Could have put together a bit better of a card. But. You know, this is the Blockbuster exclusive, so I can't really complain. And then next up, finally, we have One Night Stand Extreme Rules 2008. And um, I actually really enjoyed this pay-per-view. Um, very nice artwork here. 
you have like blood and barbed wire and um so yeah this was the final one before they did the extreme rules gimmick pay-per-view but we have uh, i'll just go through it on the insert here we actually have no barely any artwork on the back which is kind of interesting and there's your disc art and then the actual event, we have Jeff Hardy versus Umaga in a Falls Count Anywhere match. Singapore Kane match, a very entertaining match. John Cena versus JBL in a First Blood match. Damn, I missed those matches. I Quit match, Molina versus Beth Phoenix. Shawn Michaels versus Batista in a stretcher match. You have um, Randy Orton getting injured against Triple H in the Last Man Standing match when he did the RKO fall from outside, from in the ring to outside. Then you have Undertaker versus Edge in the TLC match. And then you get four historical Undertaker moments there. And, um, you know, very, very cool ending to that match, too. But uh, there you have it. We have the four pay-per-views here. If you line them up, that is what they look like. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any other pay-per-views you want me to do, I can. Or any individual pay-per-views, stuff like that. But um, for now, hope you enjoyed. Peace out.